Hi everybody, it's Amanda Ramirez with Reflect God's Beauty, and today I'm going to be doing a favorites video. I know that a lot of people usually do it, like, for the month, like, they'll do last month, this month, and then this month in um, April or May. Um, for me, I'm going to be doing mine maybe, like, every three months or so, just because I don't always buy, um that many products. So it'll be every few months that I do a favorites video. So I'm going to get started. I made a little list of all my favorite things so I don't forget anything. So um, number one is not a beauty product. I recently bought this. Um, I'm very much into juicing and I, I just really like it and it's something different besides, you know, just, you know, scarfing down whatever. Um, am I a fan of scarfing down whatever you want to eat? Yes, I am. If I want a cheeseburger, I'm going to eat a cheeseburger, you know, so I'm not going to like flip out about anything like that. But I do like juicing, um, so I went and got myself this, I'm just going to show the box. Um, this Deluxe Juicer by GNC. There we go. We see it in the sunlight. Um, Deluxe Juicer by GNC. It's 700 watt. Comes with a juice pitcher, the micro mesh filter, pop container, food pusher, and a large feeding tube. And it was actually on sale. It was $20. Usually, I believe it's about, about like 50 or so, maybe. I'm not sure. But um, the guy at the store was actually really nice. The sale was only for GNC card holders, and I'm not one. Um, but he was really nice and gave it to me at the $20. So um, it works great. I had gotten a different juicer, and it came not working. So this was kind of a replacement. Um, so, yeah, I really like it. It works really good, and um, it makes really good juice. So, uh Usually I do like an orange, spinach, strawberry, carrot, you know, whatever I could just think of. So um, it came out really good. So maybe I'll do a juicing video soon to show you guys what I like making. Um, also, another random. Um, I didn't have a jar for my juice. I would just drink it out of my like plastic cup. But I like putting it in a jar. So I just use a sweet leaf tea um, iced tea jar that I had left over. I cleaned it out and I put my juice in this. So, um, and refrigerate it and I take it with me. So, yeah. The only thing is, if this breaks, I'm kind of screwed. But, it'll be good. Sorry I said that. I mean, I it'd be messed up if I break this. Yeah, I didn't mean to say that word. Um, so, on to, I guess, the, uh, beauty favorites. Um, First thing is this brush kit that I got from Walmart. I'm trying to like move the light so you guys can see it because it's really sunny out. But um, this brush kit that I got from Walmart, it brings a powder brush, blush, eyeshadow, eye blending, sponge applicator, eyeliner, brow, lash and brow, and lip brush. And it comes with a mirror inside of it. You just flip this. I'll hold all these so they don't fall out. But it brings a mirror, and I hardly ever use the mirror. I use the mirror more in my caboodle than I use this. But they're really good. I like them. Um, next on the list is something I've had for a really long time. And I like, uh, I barely use it just because it kind of irritated my skin. But I love the scent. And it's actually discontinued right now. It is Love Spell from Victoria's Secret. It is the Shimmer Lotion. Oh, well, it just, it's really, it's making noise. Great. Um, it's just really shimmery, and I love the smell. It's always been my, like, favorite scent ever, Love Spell. And when it got discontinued, I was very sad. But, yeah, so, I'm sorry if the sunlight is stopping you guys from seeing the stuff. I'm going to close the blinds, see if it helps.
Okay. Sorry for that. Okay, it helps. So good. Um, <clears throat> next thing on my list. Oh, it's like this is like my all-time favorite thing right now. I like just adore it. Is the Elf Brow Kit. I said this in my last video of um, my. Uh, actually, no, I didn't because my last video was BH Cosmetics. Um, I did another video, which I have yet to post because it's kind of long. Um, and in it, I said that I really like this e.l.f. brow kit. So it's in the shade Light. And they're really inexpensive. It was about maybe like $3. But it just has the cream brow shade and then a shadow shade to fill in. So, and it comes with a little mirror. So... I really adore this right now. It's like probably my like top favorite thing. So yes, that's one of my other favorites. Another thing I got is this e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set. And it works really good. You just take it and close your eyes and just spray on, spray on your face. Let it dry and it keeps your makeup on and it works really well. And it was really inexpensive too. e.l.f. has great products. So next, um, this is almost empty, but I like love it. I love dyeing my hair a lot myself and I, I damage it and I mess it up and you know, I'll admit it. Um, and I shouldn't cause it's really bad, but this is another one of my favorites. My cousin told me about this. It is the three minute miracle moist, um, three times the moisture in three minutes. So you just put it in your hair for three minutes. And it really does help. Um, I tend to get a lot of split ends, and this has helped me a lot. I actually had gotten the two-pack. It was about, I think, like $6 at Target for two. So I don't know if they're still doing that, but um, it's pretty much empty. I have to refill on this because this is really good. So I got it at Target. I believe they have it at Walmart, too. So another favorite, this is like a three set, is... Garnier Nutris Triple Nutrition. I actually got this around Christmas time, after Christmas. Um, it came in a three set, actually a four set. It came with a uh, oil mister for your hair, skin, and body. Um, but that one, I, I actually don't like the mist, the oil, because it if you use a lot of it, you come out looking really greasy. Like, your hair turns out really greasy, and you just have to use it sparingly, and I'm not good at using things sparingly, so. Um, this is the 3 Minute Undo. I used this, too, also, because I, I ran out of this, so I used this when I dyed my hair, and it works really, really well. Um, another thing that I always, always, always use when I dye my hair is um, ORS Olive Oil Replenish replenishing pack I always use this when I dye my hair so if I buy hair dye I buy this and I, I dye my hair and then I slather this on my head for 45 minutes you can either leave it on for 15 with heat or you can leave it without heat for 45 minutes to an hour to uh, help bring moisture back into your hair speaking of hair I, um, back in beginning of January, or end of December, I ordered Hair Affinity. I love Hair Affinity. Um, I did the first month, and honestly, not even lying, within the first week, I could tell a difference in the way my hair was feeling. So, I did one month, and then I skipped another month, because I didn't have the money to get it, and then I got the second month recently, and... I've been taking it for about probably like a week, two weeks. And again, in a week, I could tell a difference. I was telling my mom the other day that my hairline just felt different. And um, so the only thing I noticed with this second round that I did, the pills looked a little bit different. You take two pills every day and... I'm not a fan of taking pills. I actually hate it. It's like 
the worst thing in the universe. But I really do want my hair to grow. So that's why I take these because I really want long hair. So um, these are what the pills look like. They're kind of big in my opinion. Like I said, I don't like taking pills at all. But I noticed that they look a little more yellow than they did the first time around. So I don't know if they changed anything. You could smell them a lot more too. They smell like prenatals. So, um, but yeah. Um, the color's a little bit different, but it still works amazing. So, I'm probably about halfway, I think. But, uh, I have to... I, I love this. I love this stuff. They did really good with this. So, Hairfinity by Brock Beauty. Order it. It's really worth it. It really is. Yes. Um, another favorite... Oh, I put this over the wrong spot. Another favorite that I have is the Replenishing Apricot Scrub by Equate Beauty. I did this in my last video um, that I actually have yet to post, so this is kind of new for you guys to see. Um, so yes, this works really good to take off makeup and just exfoliate your face and make you feel refreshed. So it is soothing and invigorating to the skin, oil-free, dermatologist tested, sulfate and paraben free. So it's really good, So and it's really cheap, so it's a good buy, Walmart, get it. Um, next on here, is Love and Beauty by Forever 21 Black Mascara Volumizing Length. Um, I got this at Forever 21 recently, and I really like it. I've tried it like twice. I love the brush. I love that it's really big and just makes your lashes beautiful. I don't have any mascara on right now because I just didn't feel like putting it on just for a video. So, um, another favorite is the Stay Matte Rimmel London. I use this as a powder in uh, Sandstorm. That's my shade. I don't have it on today because I actually used um, something else to do my face today. But um, yeah, I love this. It's one of my favorites. Go to. Love it. Another thing that I really like and I actually put on before I put my makeup is this oil-free acne stress control by Neutrogena. It has micro clear technology and um, it's three in one hydrating acne treatment. I put this on my face like because I I've been noticing that I tend to get really red um, after I take my makeup off like my face has just been getting really red around my t-zone and my cheeks so I put this on it treats acne even before it emerges hydrates and softens and reduces redness so I'll put this on my face let it dry and then do my makeup so and then I put this on after I wash my face with my scrub so yes hand in hand um another favorite is this NYC eyeliner duo and like I said in a previous video I believe I used the black for the eyeliner and I use the tan for lip liner. So, usually the tan is supposed to be for your eyes, but you can use it for whatever. Um, it, again, it's NYC. And it is the eyeliner duet in Triple Eight Unforgettable. That's the name of it. It says right there, Triple Eight Unforgettable, if you want to buy that. Got it at Walmart. It was like a dollar something, so really good. Um, another favorite that I have is, I don't have the brand of this, and it's kind of dirty, I apologize. It's these eyebrow shavers. Um, yes, this is probably responsible for my little bald spots and my eyebrows being too thin, and yeah, it probably is, but I just really like it. I've always used them and to shape and you know, get rid of the teeny hairs that you get up here. So you have to be very careful, though, because they can cut you. They are sharp. So, um, yeah, but I always use this, and it's definitely one of my favorites. So, but I use it every once in a while. Another favorite is Onyx Professionals Professional Remover 100% Pure Acetone by Onyx Professionals. It is maximum strength, and I got it at Walmart, and... I I haven't used it that much. I got it a while back. It wasn't that much money. And um, 
It easily removes artificial nails, glitter polish, nail polish, gel polish, nail glue, and more. So it really does help with the glitter polish. I love glittery polishes and um, they're just a pain in the butt to take off. So this works really good. I used it yesterday or the day before to take off my glitter nail polish and it just like wiped it right away. I was like serious because I've hardly used this. So I was just amazed. I bought it actually because I had acrylic nails on and I wanted to take them off. So I soaked my fingers in this. this that was a while back. But um, it really does work. It's really great and it's really cheap. It's at Walmart down in the bottom shelf near the uh, cotton balls. So just look for this. Um, my last favorite is, it can coincide with this, is Pure Ice Glitter Nail Polish in Spitfire. So that's the name of the polish. It's Spitfire down in the bottom. And this is my all-time favorite nail polish. I love it. 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 I can't express how much I love this. It just makes me happy, and it's so sparkly and pretty. And it just is very, very nice. Um, I've noticed, actually, a lot of... I'm not going to say that they were the first people to do this shade, but a lot of nail polish brands have, like, replicas of this shade. Sally Hansen, like everybody I've noticed in the store that like I'll look and I'll be like, that looks just like Spitfire. So it's it probably a really popular, you know, look. Sometimes they're hard to find. Um, usually I buy like two of them when I do get them. Again, they're like under $2, very cheap. So um, I know it's hard to read the font. I'm sorry. So it's Pure Ice Spitfire. And, oh. Another favorite that I have is Victoria's Secret Mint Shiny in Beauty Rush. I was going to say Lus. Rush. Beauty Rush. Um, Minty Shine Victoria's Secret. And the shade is Minty Kiss. So I got this at Victoria's Secret. It's just really good. It just puts a little shine on your lips. Because again, girls love shine and sparkle and glitter and all that fun stuff so that oh one more thing it's kind of dirty but I got this at forever 21 it is uh, their version of a beauty blender and it works really well I use it for underneath my eyes and it just it really just helps get in the crease of your eyes and all the little places that are very difficult to reach with normal uh, like the square triangle shaped uh foundation applicators like the old school ones um these work really well the egg shaped you can wet these and use it that way or you could use it dry and they just squeeze out and i noticed that it was so funny because when it first uh dried out uh it became like huge i was like what happened to this so yeah they're just really fun 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 um, and again, I got this at Forever 21 for like $4, so not that bad. Um, that is about it for my favorites video. Um, like I said, I am probably just going to do this every few months because I don't go shopping all the time. So it'll be probably about every three months I'll do a favorites video if I, you know, get more stuff. Um, side note, the BH Cosmetics things that I bought, I tried them last night. And they work really good. And I will definitely be ordering from BH Cosmetics again. So, um, yeah, that's about it. Everybody have a blessed, beautiful day. And, again, just embrace what God gave you. Work with it. Have fun. And just have a really fun, happy, joyful, blessed day. I will talk to you guys again soon with a different video. And don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe down in the bottom bar. And share this with your friends. And check us out on Facebook. I'll put links to the Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram accounts. So everybody just have a beautiful, blessed day. And I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye!